if square root of m plus square root of n minus square root of p is equal to 0 then find m plus n minus p whole square let us consider square root of m plus square root of n minus square root of p is equal to 0 it is given to us we can transpose square root of p to the right hand side so we will get square root of m plus square root of n is equal to square root of p now we can square both of the sides after squaring both of the sides we will get square root of m plus square root of n whole square is equal to square of square root of p now using the identity a plus p whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus twice of ab here a stands for square root of m and b stands for square root of n we can expand left hand side as it is like a square then b square then twice of a multiplied by b right hand side is square of square root of p it is p itself now similarly m it is n then it is twice of square root of the product mn and it is all equal to p now we can transpose twice of square root of mn to the right hand side and we can transpose p to the left hand side doing so we will get m plus n minus p is equal to minus twice of square root of product of m and n now once again we can square both sides so after squaring both sides we will get m plus n minus p whole square is equal to square of minus 2 multiplied by square root of mn so square of minus 2 is nothing but 4 and square of square root of a number is number itself so it is 4 times of mn and left hand side is m plus n minus p whole square so we have proved that m plus n minus p whole square is equal to 4 times of mn